Chinese Kung Fu has a long history, going back more than a thousand years. But even today, its power still not has been exhausted. The various techniques are still being improved on. In fact, there are very many different fighting skills under the single heading of Chinese Kung Fu. And their practice not only strengthens the body and provides the individual with a controlled system of self-defense, it also serves as an excellent concentration for the mind. In the study of the theory and practice of Kung Fu, harnessed to the individual's own personal requirements, produces a formidable fighting man. Most of the movements in Kung Fu are modeled on various animals. For instance, the tiger, the leopard, the praying mantis, the eagle, the monkey, the crane, and the snake. Of all the various movements, that of the crane and the snake are the most refined and most difficult. If a man can master them, he will be an exceptional fighter. The crane is a very intelligent bird, and its flight is very beautiful as well. Gentle wing movements lend a deceptive air of peace. It also possesses powerful feet. Though in flight, these cannot be put to much use. If attacked while in the air, the crane neither fights back with his wings nor his feet, but with his feet. Many a predator has thought twice about attacking after feeling the sharp edge of the crane's beak. When practicing this style of kung fu, it is necessary to attack the enemy in the manner of the crane. With his beak. The snake, on the other hand, is one of the fastest creatures there is over the ground. The sense of smell and sight exceptionally acute. Usually a snake will lie still till it sees what is around it. But once it is ready to attack, it will raise its head in order to strike. The snake is basically peaceful. It won't attack unless threatened. It won't chase after the enemy. If someone learning the snake style of Kung Fu has to develop a great capacity for stealth of movement. In attack, must be very swift. There are many varieties of Kung Fu. It is impossible to learn them all. But any one of them, or a combination, can transform a man into a powerful fighting machine, the equal of anybody alive. It all happened 20 years ago. Hong Kong Chan, Tin Yi Fei, and I were sworn blood brothers. We got on well together, and we excelled at Kung Fu. We gave aid to the weak, and were well known among the poor people. But I never guessed that Hong Kong Shan was really a traitor working for the Qing, until he tried to kill Tin and me. To make matters worse, perhaps because I was young, I believed Hung's story about brother Tin. And I suspected him too. So I collaborated with Hung. But Tin already knew something was up. And had become wary of Hung. He decided at the last to go off on his own. Hung persuaded me that brother Tin had stolen the snake crane secret for himself. And that he worked for the Ching. All right, brother, I didn't cheat you, but he's past saving. We can't show mercy. You can't. Don't hesitate for a moment. Oh, what are you doing? Well, about a surprise, brother. I know very well what game you're playing. You? Brother, we're in this thing together now. No matter what you might like, nothing's going to change that. So even you have become rotten. How dare you say that? You've got no right to. We were blood brothers once. Now hand it over and get out of here. What do you mean? Brother, don't talk to him. Get him.
What are you doing? Oh, brother, I figured Tim wouldn't come alone, so I brought some help. So he killed Brother Tin, but Hung wasn't satisfied. He wanted more. He wanted to kill the children, too. Brother? Kill a lot of them. They'll only make trouble. Brother, they're children. Don't start acting like a woman. Mister, you have killed too much already. These kids are innocent. If you don't stop, you live to regret it. Brother, forget it. Then it's your turn. So you're the real traitor to the king. It's too late now, even if you do know. I was badly hurt, but I escaped. I intended to go away and never return. But I just can't forget it. I'm sorry for what I did. So, did you cannot really blame yourself. It wasn't your fault that it happened. No. Ken was murdered. And his boys were both rescued by this monk. I've been trying to find them. But up until now, I've no news. If they're both well. What is it you want to do? I have come on a long journey here to ask your instructions on what to do. Father's name be praised. That monk you mentioned happens to be an old colleague of mine. Oh, and the children? Brother Snake is always traveling. He came here 20 years ago and asked me to take care of the younger boy. I've kept him here with me. I've been teaching him Kung Fu. He's called Erlang. As for the older boy, Snake took him with him. I have no news of them. If Erlang's here with you, I needn't worry about him. Just the older boy. Oh. Thank you very much, but I have to go. Oh, why are you in such a hurry? I will not rest until I found the older boy, the one called Tarlung. Take good care of yourself. Goodbye and thank you. Excuse me, sir. We searched all the temple grounds, but we found nobody. Nor was there any... 
Nothing there? Nothing at all? Sorry, sir. We failed in our duty. Forgive us. You can't blame yourself. They are too well organized and expert at Kung Fu. From now on, we will act in secret. Yes, of course, sir. sir. You may rise. Thank you, Thank sir. You, sir. Are you aware why you could find nothing? Well, there's a man called Erlang at the temple. Yes, I know. He keeps a secret book. <laughs> Don't look so surprised. I know. I have spies everywhere. <laughs> He's a fool. We'll soon have him. And when you do get that book, I want that book here with me. Yes, yes sir. About 20 years old. The secret book's important. But more important than that is the secret name list. From what I know, everyone's after that book. They must think it's important. I know. But the Ching are even keener to obtain the name list of the Sun and Moon Association. Oh, I see. So that's why they're looking for the book. If the Ching should get their hands on that list, it would be bad for us. There's no time to lose. We must find our lane.
Sun and Moon Group? Yes, sir. They are very tricky. Hard to catch. Oh. If you ask me, we should attack the temple. Huh. But don't you realize the temple's too famous for that? It's very old. Too many people go there. Suppose we go and then find nothing. I didn't think of that. I hear that another person has entered the scene, called Han Kuei. Yes, sir. I order you to kill him. Hey, what would you like to order? Just tea. Just tea? Uh. What have you put into this tea? Mm -hmm. It's poison. I'm not going to bother killing you. You can tell Hong Kong Shan to meet me. Very good kung fu. Huh? I knew that you were waiting there. That's why I was practicing to let you know. Oh, that's so. I really don't like people creeping up behind me. What about yourself? 
<laughs> Little friend, easy now. The abbot's been most concerned about your safety. And so, he sent me to look after you. The abbot sent you here? Hmm. You see, he feels the while he can't object to you living on your own. He's upset you took the secret kung fu book. The abbot wants to have it back. So hand it over now. And I'll return it to the temple. Quick! <laughs> Don't try to fool me. You're lying. If the abbot wants it, he'd come here himself. He'd never send someone in his place. Come now. Who the hell are you, young fella? You're quite smart. But not smart enough for the likes of me. Hey! Hey! what you had to do. Straight you back to your old tricks. Yeah, no need to tell me I'm lucky to be alive. I'm at a killer today. Oh. Oh. An officer. The chief escort. Oh. Where is he? Uh, uh, I, I ran away from him. No, you didn't. Uh, uh. Hell over my thing. Uh, uh, oh, oh. Don't look at me. Here it is. your lesson you won't forget. <laughs> All right. I'll give it to you. But first, you have to let him go. <laughs> hmm. Uh. <coughs> uh. 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 <laughs> uh, why did you give him a gong fu book? Because if I didn't, you'd be dead. What's that? Uh, you have to be her line. How could you hand over the book? None of your business. Huh? What do you mean? Huh. You've no right to it. Uh. Huh. No point chasing him. He's got away already. Don't you know he's an officer, the chief escort? What? Don't you realize what you've done? Hong will get hold of it now.
You're all useless, all of you. What rubbish is this here? <laughs> Take a look at it. Now you go and get that book now. If not, let him be an example to you. Sir? Yes, sir. Ten tongues out back yet. Uh, uh, I hope nothing has happened. Uh, we had better wait for a while. on the way Go, Chantung. 
Thank you for saving my life last night. Are you all right now? Yes, I'm much better, thanks. Then you're ready to go. Before I do, there is something I would like to say to you. Uh -huh. The Qing conquered our beloved country. They may be our rulers, but mister, with your Kung Fu skill, you should do something to help us against the Qing. For the sake of our country, we must drive the Qing from power. Oh, yes, sir. Yes. Uh, everybody uh, leave, please. Uh, thank you. Uh, please come another day. Uh, everybody, uh, thank you. Uh, thank you. <laughs> Are you Mr. Erlang? Oh, I am. I am shouting son. Master Hung knows that you want to see him. So he sent me to fetch you. But before I take you to meet him, will you show me the book? It won't be necessary. What do you mean by that? I'm gonna wait till I meet Hung personally before I get the book. Hmm. But I am his personal envoy. You can show me the book. It's the same thing. Is it? Hmm. Sure about that. Hmm. Go and tell Mr. Hunt to come here. You? Maybe Mr. Hung doesn't want the book. Don't get the wrong idea. Mr. Hung doesn't go out often. That is the only reason that I hesitate. If you really want, I will go back and talk to him and tell him to send you an invitation. Oh. It's all right by me. Go! <laughs> The name list, then I will go and have an audience with the Emperor. <laughs> He'll be pleased. I'm sure to be greatly rewarded. Congratulations, Master. You always were so smart. You deserve to succeed. King Sam? Yes, sir. I will meet with Erlang in two days' time. Sir. I'd like to buy a picture. Mm. A fighting hero. I know. We haven't got one right now. Please come again. Oh, I'll pay a deposit. Thank you.
from the information we've got. Uh, Lang is going to deliver the nameless to home. So we must act immediately. That's right. We mustn't let Hoon get that list, no matter what it costs us. I think we should make our move now and not wait. Right. Every minute we waste, the danger increases. Uh, what a stupid fool that young lad is. But, mister, we must do something now. We can't wait any longer. Let's go and talk to him. Maybe I can persuade him not to. We know you're in cahoots with the Ching. We've come for a talk. Really? Okay, then. You better listen to them. Don't be such a fool. Huh. I am your uncle, Hang. How dare you say you're my uncle? My boy. I am sorry about your father. I know you must hate me. Huh. That's enough. I'm far too busy. I've no time to talk to you. My boy, listen to me. I know you hate me, but even so, that's no reason for betraying your country. That's right. Aren't all of us here of the same blood? How can you let foreigners stay in possession of our country, making our people slaves? Huh. I do what I want to do, that's all. I'm warning you. It's none of your business. If any of you dare enter the circle, I'll teach you a good lesson. You stupid girl! obligation to the lad. I must let him have his own way. Hold it! What are you doing? Don't you know these are government premises? Go on, get the hell out of here! I'll come here to talk to you. No shouting sign to come out. 
Hey, you've got a big man. How do you talk to us like that? All right. You let him in? Or are you not? That's enough from you. Get him! <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> Mr. Erlang, so you're here. Welcome. <laughs> Quite a reception committee. You stupid fools! If you should offend Master Hung's guest, you'll be punished! <laughs> Won't you please step inside? Please. Hmm. <clears throat> Greetings, Master Hung. Mm, get up. Thank, Thank you, Master. Master. So you are Erlang. Uh, yes. Mm, that's good. You bring the book with you? Yes, I have. I told you. It is for Master Hung only. All right. Exactly sure why you've agreed. The secret books wanted by many people. Therefore, why do you allow me to have? Uh, because, Master, I wanted the chance to serve you as an officer, if that's all right. Oh. You will soon find out if you work for me that I can be very generous. Oh, thank you, sir. Mm. Is that? What did you say? I thought you wanted the secret Kung Fu book. Let him stay here with us. Sir! Thank you, Master Hong. <laughs> you fool. Chan and Shao to come here. Yes, sir.
Reporting, sir. I've read nearly all of it, but it doesn't seem to make any sense. Master, perhaps the name list isn't in it. Impossible. The Sun and Moon Association want it. List must be here. I suppose you're right. Then it must be in a secret code. Mm. I've always taken you into my confidence. You look at the book and tell me what you think of it. Yes, I will, sir. Kong Liang, you yes, can go thank too. thank you, sir. Pa, I pa, revenge your mother. What do you want? I have something to discuss with you. Hmm. So I've come here to ask you a series of questions. Oh? Look, Erlang. You say you want to work for us because you want to be an officer. <laughs> That's right. I think that isn't true. What's the real reason? What do you mean? Hmm. It's quite simple. You handed the book over to us, but you've omitted to tell us the code. I think you're still playing games with us. You? Hmm? <laughs> All right, I'll tell you. This one's called <laughs> Crane Head and Tail. And that's Crane in the Dark. Ever heard of that before? Oh! Uh. <laughs> Do you know this one? Hmm? It's called The Crane Goes Back to His Nest. You lying. Huh? Do you still really want to know the code? To read the secret book? Hmm. Hey, hey! We're still friends, so I would hope. You aren't angry. All right. We'll try it and see. <laughs> oh, oh. Thank <laughs> you. 
Sure, I've seen him before. But that's impossible. But I'm telling the truth. You two just don't get on together. I've known that for a long time. But you shouldn't do this and try to slander him. But he's... That's enough. Levoque. Please forgive me. When I was fighting, no. When that stranger attacked me, the book accidentally fell in the water. So, it's Tin Kong Wang. Huh. Well, I'll give you... Final order, before you fulfill your usefulness. Ting Sam. Yes, sir. You did a good job. Get up now. Thank you, Master. Ting Sam. What's the matter? What do you want? I'm sorry to disturb you at such an hour. But you see, Master Hung's just got some news. The trainers are meeting tomorrow. He wants you to look into it. Really, does he? Where's the meeting? Chenchu Ruins. Chenchu Ruins? <laughs> No time to explain now. You're a filthy traitor. <laughs> right you are. I have to be. When others plot against the Ching, it's my duty to do everything in my power to stop them. You're a running dog of the Ching traitors. <laughs> you won't get away from me this time. <laughs> no, will you. I'm going to kill you today. Ha! <laughs> 
an urgent mission. All right. I'm from the Chinghu Chan, Kai Shu Han. Good lad. Do you still remember me? It's you, Uncle. Uncle. He's your brother, Erlan. Huh? That's impossible. Don't fool me, but it's true. Before your father died, he bought some jade which he cut into two pieces. Game to his sons. You have one half, he has the other. It was his wish that you two would always get on well together. Brother. Brother. I've completed my work. Time for me to go. No, mister. You can't just go away like that. There's still too many things left where we're going to need your help. No? Uncle Han! He's gone already. Hold on. Don't worry, we'll get our revenge. No! I want it now. I won't wait. No, Alan. You have to understand. Your country has to come first, before revenge. It's our family's business. Not yours. Uh, you... Alan. It's our duty to take revenge. I can't blame you for that. But you need to think it out first. Did you get the nameless, the Hong Kong Shan? I did it to get close to him. So I could kill him. I understand. But by doing that, you've also placed the Sun and Moon Association in danger. Shut up. All right. Father, why are you helping strangers? Don't be stupid. We're all in this together, aren't we? What I find strange, though, is how do you become a chief escort of the Chen? I did that to be a spy. For so many years, you must have had plenty of chances to kill him. But I had to be patient. The country comes first. <laughs> That's enough talk. You're just scared of being killed. That's why he didn't dare take your revenge. All right, you. All right, don't be crazy. Hong's an expert at Kung Fu. <laughs> if you're afraid, I'll go and find him along. I'm not afraid of God if I have to. All right. Don't stop him. He's my brother. I can't just stand by and see him get killed. But you can't. Go and get all the men ready. Put them on alert. Bush, just the two of you. I can handle you too easily. 
Ting Kong Lang. You dare betray me? You murdered our father in cold blood. Now you're gonna pay for it. Mm -hmm. So you're the sons of Tin Yi Fei. That's right. All right. I'm gonna finish you both off today. <laughs> yours has. Because of my Gung Fu, I've been promoted to a very high position. You running dog! To each his own, but I will make you eat those words. Let's all kill him together! Nephews, go! Uncle, if you don't go, We'll be able to take revenge later. All right, let's go. I'm late, sir. Half of them. Yes.
Brother, now let's practice our Kung Fu. Right. summoned to the capital to see the king to discuss how to kill the rebels. Congratulations, that, that is good, good news. news. Hmm. If we succeed in putting the rebels down, I will be promoted again. When are you gonna leave for the capital? Hmm. Well, I would like to go to the temple first and say my prayers. It's an important journey. Kung Fu is very skillful. Even Uncle Han can't beat him. Uh, must be he has a secret. He uses a finger fist. It's hard to fight him. Doesn't he have any weak place? Yes. He has developed the habit when he's jumping up of turning left. On his hand, he's turned right and he's left exposed. Oh, the left hand, but the right finger. them to me. Ha! 
is too tricky. He's an old fox. We have to practice hard. Think of a way to get him. But you're not healed yet. I can't worry about that. I have no time left. The sun and moon fighters have dared to offend me and tried to kill me. You ordered us to come here. We're honored to be asked to fight for you. We will look after them. Hmm. That's right. We can handle these rebels. It'll be no problem at all. I don't think they're going to be any match for us at all. Right. I'll start on my journey to see the king. Move in the troops. Kill the rebels. King Sam. Yes, sir. Get ready. I go tomorrow. Sir. will have to give up his life. Brother, Alan, go. I'm sorry. 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 I'
Ah. well, and he died for his country. Come on, get up. You must continue your brother's work helping our country. Hong Kong Sam was killed. The secret name list was safe, and the people were stirred into rebellion against their tyrannical rulers. The Qing dynasty was not destined to last long.